Now at 6 and streaming on CBSN Los Angeles, a terrifying crowd surge at a UCLA basketball game. Good evening, I'm Leslie Medin. And I'm Chris Holmstrom. UCLA students say it was a chaotic scene when a large crowd showed up right outside the arena. And the game between UCLA and Villanova was sold out. CBS 2's Jeff Nguyen is live in Westwood with the details. Jeff. Leslie and Chris, this is Poly Pavilion. And if you're not familiar with the UCLA campus, this is what's, what's known as Bruin Walk. Well, the line to get in last night extended all the way up that hill up to the dorms, which are well beyond those trees. The line outside Poly Pavilion started to form hours before the men's basketball game between UCLA and Villanova, both ranked in the top five nationally. Garland Horowitz was in that line for 10 and a half hours. We were all very scared, I would say, because it was like people were pushing us from behind. It was just nerve wracking. It happened before tip off. Other students have said they were concerned about a repeat of the deadly crowd surge that happened in Texas during a music festival in which Travis Scott performed. Some UCLA students say the line went up Bruin Walk to the dorms in the hills above campus. This is video of that line Friday evening recorded by journalist Sam Conan. There was a little bit of pushing and shoving and people just kind of funneling in instead of staying in two orderly lines and then after that it just kind of Devolved. Lane Ford was in line for about eight hours. She says the problems came when groups of people started to cut the line and the ticketing app, which includes vaccine verification, suffered hiccups. For me, the app malfunctioned a couple of times, so I had to log out and log back in. All of the students we talked to said they're excited to see the renaissance of the legendary basketball program and the school spirit on display during a big win for the Bruins. UCLA's athletic director sent out a tweet that read in part, we were not adequately staffed to handle the turnout. I apologize and it will be corrected moving forward. And I know they were trying their best, but there was a lot, like many more students than they were expecting. So it was difficult for them to corral everyone. Both the athletics department and the university's medical center say that there were no injuries associated with the game. We are live at UCLA, Jeff Nguyen, CBS 2 News.